Red Dead Redemption 2 could feature microtransactions as Take-Two Interactive, the parent company of developer Rockstar Games, plans to integrate them in future games. You can't give stuff away for free in perpetuity, there's no business model in that, Take-Two CEO Strauss Zelnick said at the Cowan & Company 45th Annual Technology, Media, and Telecom Conference, as quoted by GameSpot. Grand Theft Auto 5 players have been enjoying free content in the past years from Rockstar although they are still offered the option to use real money to buy vehicles and other items instead of racking up in-game money. Whether this will be the case for Red Dead Redemption 2 or not remains to be seen at the moment. Zelnick did point out that they will be careful in using microtransactions. We are not trying to optimize the monetization of everything we do to the MTH degree, he emphasized. Red Dead Redemption 2 is one of the upcoming offerings from Take-Two. It is unclear how microtransactions will be applied in it though. Zelnick did say that their approach in making money per user will make sure that it does not ruin the experience for players, saying that they do not plan to grab the last nickel. We are convinced that we are probably from an industry view under monetizing on a peruser basis. There is wood to chop because I think we can do more and we can do more without interfering with our strategy of being the most creative and our ethical approach, which is delighting consumers," he went on to say. At the moment, not much about Red Dead Redemption 2 has been confirmed. However, Zelnik's statements suggest that it will not be free of microtransactions. The release of the Western Shooter sequel was recently pushed back from fall this year to spring 2018 to make sure the game will be in the highest quality it can be. Red Dead Redemption 2 is also expected to come with an online mode although it is being said that it will be released much later.